to go. Let's see if this goes the full three rounds. 70 kilos, amateur K1. Intense stare down going on. I'm looking forward to this one. These yeah. two look like they want to eat each other. <laughs> Straight out. Strong start. Good hands there by Louis. This is K1, we cannot clinch. Heavy loop, low kick there from Louis. Louis using his hands well. Tricky with that front leg, it's difficult to tell whether it's the teep on the head kick coming up. I'd like to see Max set out with a quick jab. Very quick start there. It's a very quick round from Louis and Max. This is only round one, they've got two more rounds. but yeah. he's not blocking that leg. So it'd be interesting to see how it will go in the later rounds. Hands there landing by Louis. Louis doing a good job of countering straight off Max's shots. Yeah. I'd like to see Max even if he throws a jab and it doesn't land, set it up with for a big straight hand. Yeah. Even just throw the jab out to make Louis kind of flinch, then throw a big straight. He, this is K1, you need to be active with your hands. The low kick's landing, but apart from that, he's not doing anything else. Louis seems to be landing those, bo those boxing combinations really well. Oh, heavy shots. Max needs to keep those hands up. That is the end Strong of the first round. Round number one. For me, that was all Louis Garbutt. Max was tapping that leg in, but apart from that. Much of all thrown, and then he's not really giving him much to think about. He's just controlling that distance and encountering. Like I said, I feel like even if he just flicked the jab out and then followed with the combos, it will work for him. Let's see if he can make the adjustments in round two. Start as quickly as he uh, did in the last round. Strong teeps there. Max starting to throw his hands yeah. down. It's a good sign. That's better disrupting the combination. Before it was a bit more one for one, Max was letting Louis, Louis go. And yeah, Louis seems up. to be fighting slightly differently to how he was in the last round. You notice he's stepping off now and he's throwing the kicks. I haven't seen a lot of the boxing combinations now. Heavy body he, kicks. Yeah, he's, he's stepping off through his teeth and his kicks. Almost eased off on the boxing. I'd like to see him using the boxing, it was working for him. Mm. Max needs to check kick. those kicks, check those kicks, take those weapons away. He seems to be the heavier hitter for now, for mm. me. Yeah. Even though there is a slight amount of bruising on Louis's leg. Yeah. I don't know if that's affecting him or not. Keep those hands high. I'd like to see Max just let his hands go. Don't worry about that kick, it's K1, you have to be boxing. Incredibly hard hitter, Louis. This is K1, no clinching throwing, is allowed. Throwing everything into those shots, isn't he? Corner team shouting very loudly at Max to hit kick. In all fairness, though he is dropping his hands, it might work. Ooh! Very Good. close Good. to that Good. one, just Good. slightly blocked. Nice double low kicks. Do he's fighting at very high paces? Interesting to see if he can maintain it. Doing a good job of that so far. Good game plan from Bloodline, Jim. That head kick will work. Yeah. Louis is dropping his hands. I didn't see that. 
for me again, Louis had that round in my opinion. Um, obviously, we're not judges, but I, I feel like Louis he rounds up. So I feel like Max needs to have an incredibly big three and maybe hope the judges yeah. have won for one and two or knock Louis out. Yeah, yeah, he might need the knockout here. If you were in the bloodline corner, what would you be saying? I'd, I'd be saying controlling that distance better. So at the minute, he's just letting him come right in and looking for that head kick. Setting off yeah. the one-two, throw one-two, then hit head kick on the half yeah. beat. You don't want to be close like he is now. He needs to be maybe a, a metre away. Yeah. Perfect distance for that head kick. Exactly. Exactly, because he's rut rushing in straight into his range, hand low, and Louis land big, big hooks every yeah, time. He's going into scrap with him. I don't feel like that will work yeah. for him. He needs to time that head kick well. Yeah. Both fighters slowing down slightly. Louis turning away, kickboxing starts. Tell you what, though, Max, Max is looking for it to come to bang. He's, he's looking, looking for, for that. I think I feel like he might feel like he needs he, it now. Yeah, absolutely. He does need a big three. Yeah, he's, he's still in this completely. Still in this yet. He's got the gas tank. He just needs one big shot to land. However, I feel like Louis is still taking it. Oh! Turning away. I'm not sure what happened there. No. I thought I was count. Max needs to put the pressure on. Louis keeps going to catch Max's leg kicks. If you can fire through, through more of those leg kicks, get him dropping Louis, the arm and then come up high with a head kick. He has visible bruising on his leg. Exactly, he's doing damage there. He needs to work that leg more. Oh! This is a brilliant round for Max. Yeah, really, really picked up, hasn't he? I think he needs to invest in that low kick more. No, no, he, he looks exhausted. Oh, sudden, sudden saying that. <laughs> a head kick narrowly missing. Head kick. Ten seconds left. Much stronger round for Max here. Do you know what? This is so interesting now. I don't know I, how. I feel for, for me. That was Max's all day, that last round. Yeah, absolutely. He suddenly pulled it out of the bag, so... I think it's how you scored the second round. I, I think it's how you scored the first and the second. Yeah. I, in my opinion, I feel like Louis bagged the first and second, yeah. and Max in the third. We are not we are not judges, we're commentators, so I'm really interested to see how that fight goes on the scorecard front. Yeah. I think one one and three were pretty pretty um, easy to score. It was round two that um, the momentum started to shift a little bit. Yeah. And it all depends for me how you score that round two it's and which yeah, way it's going to go. It's incredibly hard to kind of judge this, especially when we're commentating and talking about what we see in the moment instead of the whole fight. Yeah. So I'm, I'm really interested to see how this is, this fight's gone as a whole. Both boys are definitely the ring there. Incredible fight though. Yeah. That, that was a brilliant fight. Yeah, it really was. Especially amateur K1 balls. Very yeah. good standard. Yeah, I'm very impressed with how Max made those adjustments in round three because, yeah, he had much better round there, much better round. Louis had a bit of a flurry at the end of it, but for me, the adjustments worked really well. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner, by unanimous decision, the Blue Corner! I think the early round skip did it for him. Yeah, absolutely. He did make it look a little bit harder work for himself in that later round though. But congratulations, Louis. Good performance. He was fighting at such a high pace as well for those first three rounds, throwing everything to every shot and just non-stop pressure. I was thinking that it's going to be hard to maintain that throughout the fight. So maybe 